morning guys uh today we're heading over to uh sharp choppers by request of a lot of people um today last year i be believe it was last december somewhere around there i did a uh shopping haul video and surprisingly it was pretty popular uh for a local chain grocery store called sharp shopper so that's what we're gonna do we are gonna go do a grocery haul we got a budget of about 75 dollars i really don't want to spend much more than that because i have a couple of other stuff i want to get so let's get to it i'll see you there <music> So got everything packed up into the car. Did we stay on budget? Heck no. Never stay on budget. <laughs> not with two not with two boys growing up. So uh, I'll show you my receipt here in a minute and then we'll get home, we'll unpack it all and I'll show you what I got. Our whole total for the whole entire trip, 92.16. I'll see you at home and show you what we got. Woo! We are back. Uh, finally at home and yes, I have it on my couch because my kitchen table is otherwise occupied. So let's get into it and show you what I got. All right, starting on this side and as you will see, not everything here is healthy belthy and that's okay. Take a breather. Some of it has, is for school. So first, we've got some little mini peppers. Those are always good. Those are good for uh, snacking and in salads. We've got a bag of uh, Pink Lady apples. Those were $3.99. Uh, we got a thing of a uh, couple of raw broccoli heads. Uh, I believe these were $1.95 for about one and a quarter pound. Those are also good for salads and snacking. Uh, got a gallon of uh, whole milk. It was a little bit on the expensive side today. It was over $4. Normally it's under 3 But today, today milk prices are a little on the higher side. Um, we got 18 eggs. Uh, my kids are not big egg eaters. I, me and my husband are, so that'll be plenty. Uh, some English muffins for breakfast and for some pizza. We've got... A box of Uts uh, chips for snacking and for lunch boxes. Um, Uts are nothing. <laughs> We've got one package of uh, spring mix lettuce. Uh, one pack of angel hair pasta. We've got uh, these uh, uh, crackers here. They love these. These are always two for five. So. We got the grilled cheese flavored ones and then uh, sour cream and chives. They do not like the peanut butter at all. They can't stand the peanut butter, whereas my husband loves the peanut butter. 
uh, one knob of ginger for uh, ginger tea. It is getting to be that season. Um, I have a specific recipe that I use for ginger tea. If you'd like me to uh, do a video on it, please let me know and I will do that. Um, bag of coffee, another bag of coffee for me because why not? This was $2.99. Um, one thing Sharp Shopper is great for is coffee. They have spoiled me for coffee. They have both no name brands and as you can see, name brands. And their prices on coffee are absolutely astonishing. And God forbid, I actually have to go buy coffee at a regular store and pay over $6 a bag. That th I have a heart attack every single time. So uh, next we've got some um, forest berry uh, fruit spread, 99 cents on that. Uh, we've also got some grape jelly for sandwiches, uh, two for a dollar. Always a good deal there. Uh, next up, we've got some extra virgin olive oil for bread making and cooking, uh, 4.99. That's not bad. It's not the greatest, but it's not bad. Next, I uh, found these little cute uh, mini pepper, uh, mini cucumbers here. They're teeny tiny for $1.99. Actually, a really good deal. Uh, those will go really good in salads and just a snack on. Uh, since, you know, cucumber season's coming to an end here and all my own cucumbers are almost pretty much done for. Uh, we've got a pack of uh, romaine hearts, three romaine hearts. Uh, just a small pack of carrots. Uh, some canned chicken here for uh, chicken salad. Uh, some frozen broccoli for dinners and to add to other things. So that's uh, $2.99 there. Always a good deal on frozen vegetables there. The buy of the day, at least for me. Um, rice cauliflower, the Italian cheese flavor, 69 cents absolutely wonderful great flavor um even my kids like this uh we make uh stuffed peppers in a bowl with this uh basically brown up some they don't even realize it's not rice i don't even tell them it's cauliflower they don't know the difference just brown up some ground beef some garlic a little bit of onion um at uh, just a teeny tiny bit of olive oil depending on your preference for ground beef if it's fattier ground beef or not and then add this to it when your veggies are soft add this to it let the cheese melt wonderful even my my husband my picky husband loves this too doesn't even realize that it's not rice absolutely great uh next we got two bunches of bananas um Bananas here are a bit cheaper than anywhere else. They're about 49 cents. They're 49 cents a pound. So give or take, but bananas for the most part are cheap everywhere, at least around here. Um, one package of bacon. This is another, this is another deal that you'll always find here. Uh, bacon is absolutely amazing prices there when they have it. Sometimes they don't have it, but $2.49 for a package of bacon is outstanding. It's an amazing price. And then this was new. They've never had this before that I've ever seen. Uh, frozen Power Flapjacks, the Kodiak Cakes. I've heard really good things about these. Um, they are, for, of course, they are frozen. Probably would be better if I made my own, but, you know, whatever. Whatever makes my life easier in the morning before school, I'll take it. Um, some laundry detergent. They always do have good prices on laundry detergent as well. Uh, dish soap, cottage cheese for mom. Um, a little bit of cereal, Cheerios. My kids are not big cereal eaters, so these cups are always um, a good buy for me because the boxes end up, the boxes of the bags end up going to waste because they just don't, eat, they just don't eat it as fast they my kids could go six months without touching a bowl of cereal and so these while people see these while they are more wasteful in terms of packaging and individual packaging as far as for me they're a good deal so and three for a dollar is actually very good so 
And then we got some um, noodles here for chicken soups and for soups and things. Um, some chicken flavored base just to add just to add a little bit more flavor to it. Um, some uh, pudding because lunch boxes and yeah, that's my life. Some bread flour because I do make my own bread. I do not buy bread, so I'm at the rate that I go through bread, it's more economical for me to buy buy the flour, have the ingredients on hand, and just make it myself like twice or three times a week. That's how much bread we use. It's insane. Um, eh, some Cheez-Its because, you know, lunch boxes. So this is the 12 pack. It's got three flavors in it. And these are my kids' favorite kinds. So, and then just a bag of, uh, rusted potatoes. And that's it, guys. That is everything. I want to thank you all for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.